Ask Shrimpola. That's me! I kind of run like this. Okay. All right. And I kind of use my elbows to give me momentum. Mm, yeah, that's, yeah. You got the elbows. Very nice. Yeah. Oh, well, hello there. Welcome to Ask Shrimpola, where your questions about Jesus and the Bible get the up close and personal with my answers. That's right. Let's go ahead and take a look at our questions for today. Mm, yeah. How long do people have to wait for God's promise to save them? What was the answer to God's promise? Fantabulous questions. <laughs> I uh, suppose this is kind of like that game where you have to guess how many jelly beans are in a jar. Uh, and then the person with the best guess wins. How is answering this question like guessing jelly beans? Well, there may be a chance I do not know the exact answer. So, uh, guessing may be my only option. How about instead of you guessing, I just share what I know. Oh, that, that sounds good too. Well, it was a long time before the promise that God made got answered. We're talking hundreds of years. And the people that were around when God made the promise weren't the same ones that were around when God answered it. And that answer was Jesus. Jesus was the answer to God's promise. Now, I don't know how many years we're talking about, but it was a long time. We do know that it was 14 generations of people. Okay, so the people that were around for God's promise to be made, their great, 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 great grandson. Was I upper man? Plus or minus a great? I think you got it. Okay, 14 greats. Yeah. They would have been around to see the promise be answered. Yeah, and God was going to save everyone by sending the fulfillment of that promise. Jesus. <laughs> that is very good news. Now I know that Jesus came to save all of us. Mm -hmm. Thanks for your questions. Kids Club is on Facebook and iTunes. Get some help from an adult type person. Search for Crossroads Kids Club. Watch some videos. And have fun. <laughs> So, do you think it was 367 years, 4 months, and 2 days? We just don't know, but it was a long time before Jesus came and fulfilled God's promise.